My passion for aviation is already, uh, if I think about it, at least uh, 40 years old. So uh, it started uh, at home, my coming from the family. My father was very interested in aviation. He, he used to be a pilot as well, uh, already as a uh, young boy. And you know, reading these uh, magazines, Flugrevue uh, was in, in Germany, uh, very famous, it's still very famous. And all these uh, books about uh, flying and uh, dreaming about, one day I'm gonna start. Talking about the aircraft types I've flown so far, uh, if you want, I could start at the very beginning, which is uh, actually I've, I started with gliders, uh, some, uh, as I said, already 40 years ago. Um, joining the Air Force, of course, very soon after having finished the university study for air, air and space engineering, uh, we started to fly uh, some propeller airplanes, kind of basic training airplanes. Um, then we converted to uh, jet trainer airplanes, uh, did the whole flying training in the United States on a T-37, T-38. And finally, after one year we, of basic flying training, we converted to the, uh, our operational uh, type, which for me has been the Phantom. Uh, the, uh, meanwhile, a legacy airplane, uh, the Phantom, uh, which I appreciate to fly very much. I joined the industry to participate in the uh, Eurofighter flight test uh, program and uh, Tornado uh, upgrade flight test programs. After some time uh, I got the call, uh, was asked to join Airbus and uh, from then on of course it, it was uh, to say goodbye to fight airplanes and to concentrate more or less on uh, passenger type airplanes. But very soon I was uh, involved in the A400 program and I'm flying the A400 the most besides all, all the other Airbus type airplanes. The work of a test pilot is actually not only a flying job, uh, a great deal of uh, my work is as well uh, doing, uh, attending to meetings of course. Uh, if uh, you're involved, uh, like on the A400, very early in the program, years before the first flight, uh, you actually are not flying this airplane at all, but you do participate uh, a lot in, in meetings, in design meetings. Um, in design reviews, in simulation, where we trying to prove our concept and so on so forth. Uh, once we do the actual test flights on the airplanes, uh, you do the flights, but you as well uh, spend a lot of time preparing the flights, um, dealing with uh, test cards, setting up test cards, supporting the flight test engineers if they have questions, uh, discussing how to set up a uh, the, the flight test, the actual uh, test to be done. And afterwards, uh, after the flight, there's uh, a lot of uh, post-flight uh, post uh, processing to be done. Usually for the test pilot, uh, it's um, report writing stuff, uh, but as well uh, supporting again the engineers to, uh, in their analysis of, of all the data and uh, always giving the pilot perspective of uh, what he has seen in the cockpit, how does it feel. What do you think about? Can the airplane do the job? Can you do the role? Today, with the support of flight test instrumentation, uh, all the test flying is much more efficient. So the actual flying part of this job is less than in the old days. The other aspect is, nowadays, a test pilot spends much more time in simulations than in the old days. In the old days, the simulators were not so good or they had no simulators at all. So really everything had to be tested or tried out uh, in the air. Today we're, gonna, we're going to try everything first in the simulator, especially type of risk type of, of, of tests. We see what the simulator, we see what the simulation uh, is doing and then we go flying. We are an international team, which is it's very nice to work with, with Spanish, uh, with British, with French, uh, with German colleagues. Uh, it's, it's really a sort of integrated team which is, uh, I, I really appreciate to, to, to be in this team and to, and to work with this team. I will continue and I still just love to fly them. Look at this. Amazing. So quiet, so elegant. It's great. After 40 years I still love to fly gliders. I, uh, I have not much time, so much time to fly gliders, but I appreciate and I love, just love these airplanes. 
Uh, I still uh, looking if I look uh, and I see uh, my old phantom. It's really uh, some old emotions uh, pop up and say, I would love to to, to get uh, get in there. Uh, maybe once again, but I'm afraid it will never happen. Um, but being really realistic, so the A400 at the moment is my favorite airplane to to operate and to work with.